everyone, FBG here. Welcome back, or welcome back to more Science Generations. On the last part, we did Sea Escape and Speed Highway, and now we are doing this stage. And no, I don't care about wall jumps. I'll explain, hopefully. And if you've played a certain game called Sonic Heroes, you'll know what this stage is. The first stage. Honestly, I think this game kind of has an oversaturation of first stages. Green Hill, technically chemical plant. Sky Skyscraper is like one of the last zones of three. Has this speed high what speed, speed city escape. And I don't even remember. And Crisis City, which is later. And it's not even a first stage really. But it is for a certain character in that game and I'm not going to look forward to that character if I ever will be that game, which I hope I don't, because that game is terrible. You know what game I'm talking about if, you, if you're a fan of the Sonic series. Because it's known pretty terribly for being, well, terrible. I don't know if that's supposed to crush you back, that was supposed to crush you, but, eh. I have no idea what that was supposed to do. I have no idea what this is here for, either. Oh, there's a cannon! Ooh! Exploration! And I have no idea if you can actually control where the cannon shoots you, but... And this is Seaside Hill, by the way. <laughs> been two minutes in and I haven't even told said what the stage actually is. And this is part of Ocean Palace actually. The stage after Seaside Hill. And yeah, if you haven't noticed, a lot of Sonic stages start with the word hill. Or end with the word hill. Well, there are some other stages that start with hill. Hilltop. Which, I don't know why people are such a fan of Hilltop, but I don't want the turtles. I want to do the cart. <laughs> Darn. Yeah, the turtles are just platforms. And since the platform, or the 3D platforming part, is not that good in this game, this cart, this, this cart, this part can become pretty frustrating. Frustrating. There, I said it right. No, I think this is one of the only, well, besides the whole first stick. Actually, City Escape and Speed Highway are technically the only levels with lyrics. Well, besides Star Speedway Bad Future with the Metal Sonic fight, but that's hey, 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 over and over. Yeah, I actually, I actually found the lyrics, and it's not her, it's hey, just distorted. And since it technically is Japanese, and they cannot pronounce their L's, which is obvious if you... Um, okay, timing! I like how the music kind of distorts when you're under what... Okay, never seen that happen before. And by the way, the rival battle of this era is pathetically easy, so probably the next episode will not be long at all. Hopefully. Considering all the cutscenes, well, three cutscenes, which isn't much. Come on, load faster, thank you. And we are done with Act 2 of Seaside Hill, so let's go back into Act 1. Or, classic Seaside Hill. Which, I think Hydrosy would work very well here. And I honestly really don't like 
um, uh, Seaside Hills music. I've never really been a fan of it. I don't know why I'm, you know. It is kind of catchy, though, I'll admit it. And, uh, and with the athleticism skill, which I equipped onto uh, Classic and Modern, like, basically, jumping in the water becomes really broken. <laughs> like, not bad broken, but, like, good broken. You could speed through these levels pretty quickly. And I don't think the drowning team is even in this game. And, ugh. No, I've always wondered. People who have that as their ringtone? Yeah, I actually know someone who has the Sonic 3 drowning theme. And my voice cracked really badly there. And, oh, phone. And I am back here again. And I don't even know what I was saying before. And let me adjust the mic. Okay, it's good. I'm sorry. It felt like it wasn't near my mouth. It probably wasn't, and now the video is going to be all screwed up, and I will do probably nothing about it. Because I'm a lazy editor. Not really, because I actually am putting a lot of editing work into this LP. Which I like, because editing is actually kind of fun. And it would be a good profession for people like for LPers and such. I like it a lot. And um I was actually looking at um camps and such near like oh I always say and such a lot. But um looking at summer camps and stuff like that. I found a um summer camp that it's three hundred fifty dollars, mind you. But you get it's a computer building class. And I was like, since my computer really, really sucks, that would be nice to have. It's $350, and it pays for all the um, equipment that you need. And you actually get to take the computer home. Like, you build the computer basically for your own appeal, which I think that would be nice. But sadly, it's only for, um... Uh, I don't remember the actual age, but I know I can't do it. <laughs> and is this... I think this is the end of the stage right here. Oh no, it's moving so slow! Oh god. <laughs> of course I had the jinx at run. Run, let's do, it. You're, do what you do best. Run! <laughs> yeah, this must be the end of it. Yay! That was actually a kind of short video. <laughs> but, Rank S. I like Rank S's. Do you like Rank X? Rank X's. Yes. My grammar is amazing if you have not... Oh, God. <laughs> And here's actually one of my favorite characters in the series, but meh. And can you go? Oh. I forgot this cutscene. Hi, Classic Tales. That was an air fist bump. Do it for reals. So I think we've pieced together more of what's happening. And it's not good. Whoa. Well, hello, thing that we're only going to encounter for five seconds. Doesn't even look like it's doing anything. <laughs> Through time, it tears space apart, leaving the areas empty and dead, and sticking them in this weird white. Shouldn't this be after the boss? <laughs> when the Sonics accelerate through time, they fix space, returning color and life. That's kind of amazing, actually. How could one, well, two run people like running no tomorrow, through? Or there won't be a tomorrow. Well, how could people running through an area bring back color and light? Well. In a symbolic-ish way, like in CD, which. Uh... Thank you, my friend. Beware, for I have looked into the soul of our enemy, 
and I saw only darkness. Okay, that's actually a pretty cool voice actor. <laughs> hmm. Ooh, ninja skills! So, now we have challenge gates. So, on the next episode of Let's Play Sonic Generation, I have not said Let's Play in the past two episodes, but on the next episode, we will do the challenges and complete the Dreamcast era. So, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.